of nowhere where we are, um, I guess you could say renting, but we're living with a friend. And I just got, um, we can get freaking groceries delivered here and it's like the coolest thing ever. So um, they just delivered. Yeah. Okay, let's unpack it all, right? And then we'll show everybody our goodies. Hi, baby! <laughs> it's a cutie. My baby girl's nine months old today. She's nine months old. Okay, so here is my Aldi haul. All of this was, I believe, one fifty-three seventy-nine. Um, honestly, I don't have the receipt because it was delivered. It's on my phone and my phone's dead and on the charger. So I wanted to do like a little haul of just what I got. I just recently, we shopped at Aldi as a kid, but I just recently started shopping at Aldi again just to save a little bit of money. Ignore the yellow kitchen. Um, anyways, so yeah, let's, let's go through some of the things that I've been finding. Trash bags, obviously way cheaper to go, not way cheaper, but definitely cheaper to go with Aldi. And actually these ones are like durable. They're not like cheap and like stretch out easily if something pokes through it. So these are good. They're the strong ones. I have found that I do like to get like my fruits and vegetables there. Some stuff I still get at Kroger, but like a lot of the, the produce is good. The meat, I'm not sold on. I still get my meat at Kroger. Um, it's not that anything's, sorry, it's not that anything's wrong with it, but I'm just picky. A bag of cherries, a bag of Honeycrisp apples. I got two things of raspberries. They look excellent. Two things of strawberries. Bananas, grapes, mushrooms, asparagus. Honestly, like we cook this for dinner too, but I like to eat it raw and like sometimes not even dipping it when it's fresh out of the garden, but like dipping it in a dip of some kind raw. Can't, can't go wrong here. Riley has been on a waffle kick lately. Yeah. Cottage yeah. cheese. Pretzels. I like to make avocado. I like to mix chicken salad, mustard, mayonnaise, avocado, hot sauce, and dip it in pretzels. Weird, but can't help myself. This hummus quartet, quartet, oh, that is what it says, <laughs> is the best thing ever. The cilantro jalapeno is a little, uh, not my favorite. It would be good like on tacos or something Mexican, but these three are fire. I got the giant tub of this salsa last time and they only had small ones this time. And then I got this um, wok, cinnamon toast crunch. This box of cereal is $1.35. And I also got a thing of Honey Nut Cheerios. This is gonna be the world's weirdest, um, what is this called? Grocery haul. These, oh my gosh, if you like spicy stuff, you have to try these at Aldi. These chili lime rolled up chips. Oh, they're so good. A bag of on the vine tomatoes. I usually get vegetables from there too, but um, we are overwhelmed with vegetables from the garden. So we are good in that department. I got this to try just to like snack on in your hand and to try a cereal. So I get all I get all of her puffs and yogurt melts from Aldi because I mean, why not? They're cheaper too. Um, so I got the strawberry ones, the blueberry ones, the blueberry yogurt bites, and the strawberry yogurt bites. This kid is like annihilating these right now. Also I get the little rice rusks and the um, white cheddar and veggie little cheese puff things. These are so good. So I don't know if you've ever tried these. A lot of people have. They've been a thing for like a couple years because I think they're like keto or something and people are all into keto. It's literally Parmesan cheese that's like cooked in the shape of a circle. These ones say they're jalapeno, but honestly, it's, it's not spicy at all. It just gives it flavor. They're a good little like 
Oh, I don't know. They're good. I like them. The best bread ever. It has like a little sweet taste to it. It just makes sandwiches taste better in my opinion. Not a sweet taste enough to where you're like, ew, this tastes like it's supposed to be dessert. Um, but yeah, and it comes in a half loaf and I like that for, I don't know, like sometimes we don't go through that much bread. Um, and so it's nice to just only have half for us. And then sometimes we do go through a lot of bread and I need three of these. But I will pay the price for three of these versus one loaf because I like the taste of it. Paper plates, because there's no dishwasher here, and I'm usually a big fan of washing to save the planet, but um, yeah, mama needs help. Riley's chocolate milk, granola bars. These looked really good, I wanted to try these. They are red pepper hummus protein wraps. So yeah, I wanna try these. Cheese sticks, chipotle cheddar cheese slices, cheese tortellinis. I had the mushroom ones in the cart and they didn't have them, so we'll try these. And then turkey, pastry crisp dipping. I wanted to try a bunch of different coconut waters. Mandarins, almonds. And then I got this um, pear juice to help when we have issues with constipation around here because everybody's teething. Sorry, TMI, but life with kids. So yeah, that's my Aldi haul this time. Um, what do you like to get from Aldi? Is there any hidden gems that you get every time? Tell me because I need to know. No house update so far. Last week was nothing new happened. We're waiting for our prints to be finalized. So until our prints are finalized, we can't really move forward with bidding out the work. We might have an update towards the end of the, like end of this weekend. Um, but I don't know that that will be in this week's video. I figured I would do an Aldi haul for now. And I will hop on an update later. Okay, it's a little while later, and we just got a bunch of packages. One of them I already opened. I got these shoes off of Amazon for Parker to match with me. Oh my god. Let's try them on. Oh yeah, baby. Check out your new kicks, baby. Oh yeah. Check out them shoes. A lot of what I ordered is for little projects that I'm doing around this house. Oh, yeah, I got these. these bike shorts, ooh, these are nice. They're like the thick waistband. I like that to hold the mom situation. And this has pockets on either side for your phone. I like the color. I can't wait to try them on and see what they look like on. This is for Mitch and I, well, not really me, but Mitch. Parky, you look so cute in your shoes, baby. I got a shirt. Oh wow, this is a small thing. So we, I love this for one. I have been religiously using Alani New products for two years. Um, I started Balance right after I had Riley. The only times I haven't been taking it is when I've been pregnant. Um, Mitch is actually taking it now. Um, I also take their fish oil prenatal. Um, Mitch, Mitch takes their fish oil and balance. You're so cute, I love you. And so um, whenever we start trying to get pregnant for baby three, um, I wanted Mitch to be taking a multivitamin because he doesn't take a multivitamin. I don't know why my face isn't focusing. Is it focusing on this? So I got multivitamins from them for Mitch. So, um, and anyways, yes, excellent company. We use, Mitch drinks their energy drinks religiously every day. I can't really have caffeine while I'm breastfeeding because it makes my kids projectile vomit. What's inside? Show the camera. What is that? I know. So I got four of these. They're just towel hooks. Whoops, the command strip ones that don't damage the wall. And I'll show you where I'm gonna put them. Diaper. It's not a diaper. I got this toilet paper holder for the bathroom here. Everything here is this brushed nickel or whatever you call it. And I'll show you the situation. So in the bathroom, there is, for whatever reason, there's a picture hanging right here, but there's nowhere to hang towels. So I am going to take this down and hang the command hooks here for towels to be put up. Cause right now they're on the back of the door. So either we keep them hanging on the door or we lay them on this bench over here. But both of those are pretty far away from the actual tub. And so it would just be nice to be able to have them hanging right there so you could open the curtain and just grab it. 
so that's what these are gonna be for and then the toilet paper holder is because um, I just this is hard when you're trying to wipe a toddler's butt this just falls over so we're going to mount that toilet paper roller here so yeah that's what we got in our order hey guys so I've put these shorts on and I don't like that they're making me look like I have like camel toe or something like my other shorts don't sit like this like they're like I don't know if it's the underwear I'm wearing or what you can see the little bumps that is my underwear but it's got this weird stain on it like there's a line you can only see it uh, let's see see what it's doing that's just weird anyways there's a line that goes like all the way down and around um, I'm not super crazy about where they cut off because it, it like makes me muffin over it and the back they're not bad but they're definitely not my favorite okay and then there's the towels towel hooks my little baby just woke up yes he did 